Students, welcome back. Uh, today in this class, let us learn regarding figures of speech. What do you mean by figures of speech? Figures of speech refers to integral part of any language which are used extensively, not only in our day-to-day -day speech, but also in written form. The first one is alliteration. It is a sentence that consists of a series of words that have the same consonant sound at the beginning. For example, she, sell, see, shells, on the sea shore. A good cook could cook as much cookies as a good cook who could cook cookies. Go and gather the green leaves on the grass. So, these are all the examples of alliteration. Let us go with the second one that is anaphora. It re refers to repetition of words or phrases. For example, be bold, be brief, be gone. Get busy living or get busy dying. This is nothing but repetition of words or phrases at the beginning of the several statements. Third one is apostrophe. It addresses the subject that is not present in the work. In this case, the object is absent. Keep it in your mind, my dear students. Example, twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Seven, you are my lucky number. Alarm clock, please don't fail me. Next is hyperbole. A hyperbole refers to exaggerated terms. For example, I have told you million times not to touch my stuff. I am so hungry I could eat a horse. She is as old as the hills. So, this is nothing but exaggerating. Next is irony. Irony refers to it is a figure of speech which conveys the opposite of their literal meaning. For example, your hands are as clean as mud. The dinner you served was as hot as ice. Telling a rude customer to have a nice day. So, as clean as mud, as hot as ice. Have a nice day. These are all the irony. The next one is metaphor. Metaphor refers to it is a comparison between two things which are having something having a common but in general they are different. For example, time is money. Heart of a stone. Nothing but heart of stone. He is the star of our college. Camel is the ship of desert. So, therefore, time is compared to money. Heart is compared to stone. Star, which is compared to a student. Camel, which is compared to ship. So, nothing but metaphor. These are all the examples of metaphor. Next is simile. Simile refers to it is also a figure of speech uh, which compares two things which are different from each other but have the similar qualities. For example, braveness. For example, our soldiers are as brave as a lion. Lion is also brave. Our soldiers also brave. He eats like a pig. He is compared to pig. Because of his eating nature. She is as wise as an owl. She is like an angel. His expression was as cold as ice. So, these are all the examples of simile. The last one is personification. Personification refers to it is a qualities of human nature or human qualities to abstract. Nothing but it attributes, it represents. The opportunity knocked at his door. The lightning danced across the sky. The wind howled in the night. Time flies when you are having fun. So, these are all the examples of personification. My dear students, keep it in your mind. Figures of speech are very, very important. It is an important topic. Uh, please practice regularly and keep watching my videos for further videos. Thank you, students. Bye.